And imagine being, he was in winners until the end, then all, And then all he loses sudden. to the 37 seed MFA. Oh, we go. Yeah, MFA was just a random seed thing. I mean, Loaf was a 28 seed, to yeah. be fair. But still. And we're going to see the Bowser versus the Mint Agenda here. Yeah. Um, already just very careful neutral. Um, I'm honestly surprised we saw the forward air. Um, usually Niran opts to go for the Nair. However, my guess is it's just not technically true on PT with the frame one option. Um. I this, signed both up for that. Okay, thank you. This matchup, pretty volatile. Honestly, a lot of Bowser matchups. I think mo I think every Bowser matchup against Bowser is extremely volatile. Oh yeah. There I know there's a couple exceptions, you know, Pikachu, Luigi, and like Kazuya, but even then, Hero almost beat a uh Akala in best of five. And he That's supposedly a really bad matchup for Supposedly it's an And it was on F D it was on F D, right? Yeah, he went F D to play against the Kazi. He wanted the Kazuya. That's um, insane. So very close. Ooh, oh, yeah. Good call out on the jump get up there. Yeah, you you can't really be dropping off from ledge or jumping sometimes against Bowser. Oh, an unfortunate side B there. He's going to get him killed off stage. Yeah, I was going to say Muren's labbed out. He has, like, frame-perfect recoveries when it comes to Bowser up B. Um, he, has a, he has a little gif he plays on his phone sometimes where it does the sound of when you should be hitting B. Oh, interesting. Um, I think you max when I hit it four times, like once at the beginning, then once halfway through, and then once like, but he has that and we'll listen to it. But unfortunately, just buffered the side B. Um, very, very even. Okay, I was going, I was going to wonder if Mint was scared off into the Charizard, but luckily we're seeing the Squirtle come back, which I think is... Nair. That's the second time that's happened. That is not a true combo, so it is crazy he's going for that instead of his guaranteed confirmed forward air back air. Yeah. Good oh. side be there to call out the roll. Yeah, uh, PT doesn't have great rolls. PT is one character so with amazing uh, amazing moves, not great stats for the most part. And rolls definitely want them. So, Muren with the call outs, very, very good. Urine coming out to a huge lead here, almost slaps him in percent. Yeah, and just gonna keep hitting him with that up he had a shield. Oh, he's going oh. I was gonna say, um Oh and that's and gonna be shield dead. Break there, and it's gonna hit him with the forward smash. I was gonna say Murin was trying to show off a little bit of a tech with Bowser. Did you see where he knocked Ivysaur off stage and immediately he ran off below the stage? What he wanted to do is there's a way to reset the tether recovery with okay. up B. Um, and you just reset the recovery with up B again and again until eventually the tether can't grab ledge anymore. Interesting. And so you're just kind of clipping it. And it seems pretty easy. It's just a timing thing, he said. And we're going to see a run back at the same matchup here. They are, and they same stage? did not see what stage they're going to. I know they ban banned town. Okay. I would say Mint Chocolate is also known for having the world's worst stage counter picks. This one, granted. Worse on the Zog. Fine. Uh, yeah, he goes, he played, um, Mega Man. He played a Mega Man in winter semis before and lost the set by going to counterpicking FD against the Mega Man. Against um, the Mega Man? Yeah, which is also one of Ivy's worst matchups. <laughs> so, yeah, he does some bad ones. Once, like you said earlier about Mint like not Lizal? being able to hit these, uh, these down airs, I've never seen him hit one. Yeah, which he, means he's gonna hit one here now. No, he just he panics. Okay, I'm surprised. Good on Murin for lar largest get up attack in the game. Really good, but Mint was definitely trying to call out a panic option at ledge because it that F smash it does hit ledge. Okay. And now that Bowser's at 140, the game truly begins. Yeah. Let's see how he gets off ledge here. And we're gonna just gonna get a forward throw. That not gonna kill, Dude, but Bowser probably gonna. Oh, not going for a dare. I was gonna say Mint hits. Charizard dare, 10 times out of 10, throw is gonna that is going to kill. Middle, 160. Never mind. Bowser's Bowser is a, a big boy. Like, okay, but that but finally, the, finally the two frame. But I'm surprised that Charizard um, up throw didn't kill at 168 on the Smashville platform. I've seen that move kill at like 120, so I'm really surprised. I am very surprised. Bowser's just that heavy, I guess. And Mint's going to come out to an early full stock lead here. 
but Bowser is such a volatile character. If he didn't do that Pokemon switch right there, he was dead at 70. Nair to bear and see how he edge guards him. Almost gets reversal there, unfortunately. And I'm gonna take a moment to update the overlay. So I'm Mint gonna throw Muren off stage here and let's see how he edge guards. Goes for the Nair, doesn't time it correctly. So he's gonna let him get back onto stage for free. Muren gonna hit the side of you right into the Smashville platform. That is not quite gonna take it. Charizard, like Bowser, is very heavy. I believe probably one of the top five heaviest characters in the game. I wanna say uh, exactly fifth. Because I know, let's see, it would be Bowser, probably Incineroar. Uh, it's Gant. Bowser, K. Roll. Um, Fortel gonna take it there off the yeah. edge. Yeah. Then it's DK. Good job. Uh, DK, D. Diddy. And then it's either Ganon or I think it's Charizard then Ganon. So okay. I think fifth, maybe sixth, but very, very heavy. And Chocolate doing much better on this counter pick. Like like um like the other commentator said, Chocolate is known for his amazing counter picks and going to stages which his character thrives on. Yes, um, amazing. But yeah, no, I think uh Smashville just very good stage. Uh kind of a good stage for both, because just both are so fast and both have such good, both characters with Ivysaur and Bowser specifically have such good platform pressure um, with the dare up air from Ivy and then just side beef with Bowser. So, um, we're getting real close. I, yeah, gonna I not feel this... confident about the dare. <laughs> I okay, think gonna that's... get some damage in, get back on the stage. I mean, this is Bowser, anything can happen. Yeah, still not... But at 140, like, he's going to need to make some magic happen here. It's probably going to be a run back, but it's not out of the realm of possibility. Yeah. And it is now out of the realm of possibility. Yeah. Just getting the jump call out. So, going back to the Ludwig Invitational, Big D versus Sky J, 3-0. Big D's favor. So, Sky J is out of the tournament. So, now... Big D beats Sky J. Let's see. Big D was my first favorite player uh, because he used to be a DDD player and the best DDD in the world, and then he swapped out for the other hammer wielding character, Ice Climbers. Ah, His DDD is still really good. His neutral is insane. Um, so we're going to a much bigger stage. I agree with this. Just with such good airspeed that Bowser has compared to PT's slightly not great airspeed. I think it's just a lot more room to breathe. He felt very smothered last game, it looked like. And this definitely, hopefully, should be a little bit of a... Uh, a little bit of a space to let him do his own thing. And good combos here by Mint to get Bowser up from 0 to 80 right off the bat. This is where the game truly begins with Bowser. Yeah, it doesn't even have to go for, like, super optimal combos against Bowser. It's just kind of... Squirtle just kind of connects into himself. Oh, yeah. Squirtle, like a few other characters, like Mithra, a few others, just has all these freeform combos where you don't have to do one specific thing, but you can really do whatever you want. And and Mint, like usual, is going to miss that down air. Mint never hitting a down air in his life, but or with Ivy, he hits every single Charizard down air. Uh, However, up air not to do the nair. Kill. Bowser is heavy. I swear, Mint becomes a potential PR player as soon as he learns how to two frame with down air. Ooh, and that um, back here by Charizard going to take it out. How was that sweet spot? I mean, Sour Spot would have killed probably oh, yeah. too with Charizard back air being broken. So I'm just surprised. Bowser's a big hurt box. Yeah. It looked like it was sure way too close. Um, so already trying for the jab lock. Uh, didn't quite get it. I, going back to the Ludwig Invitational Brief, I don't know if, who actually won. Cause it says Jackal won with Steve. So like, I don't know if Jackal won, but they put in the wrong characters or if Quandale won wrong. won they said the wrong name. Um, but I guess we'll see in a second. It says Jackal on with Steve over Quandale Dingle Lingleton's Wolf. I don't think that is correct. Yeah, I'm saying Although, that also. could have happened. You never know. I could have seen, I could see either winning, so that's... So that up could there. go either way. Um, so already pretty close. Um, of course, Mint getting that early percent, which, early stock percent, which is just the usual, but finally bringing it back in like two hits. Already at a at a nice forty seven. Yeah, 
first Bowser bomb we've seen since the shield break, which honestly, the shield break just felt like insult to injury because Muren was already solidly winning game one. Oh, yeah. And then just got the shield break. Um, that could kill on town. Okay, not quite. But this is so close now. Muren brought it all the way back. Um, a lot of a little bit of um scramble and neutral. Nobody really throwing out. Well, I guess Charles was throwing out a lot of fairs, but nobody really throwing out things besides that. Oh, that he is going to be, die uh, for that up the, Yeah, that is unfortunate. He was not able to hit that. So yep, just gonna be a nice thirty-seven. Uh, Murin just opting to go for the much easier up air, just because he 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 missed the one game one, but it's. Yeah, just an early preemptive up B out of shield. Not the best with Charizard. On a good side B there. Just so, so much more sad. Oh, and he is going to die for that attempted neutral B there. And let's see if Min can bring this back. 90% okay. last time. And he's going to die to yeah. that back here. I was right going to say, not out. I've died too many times at zero on town and city from Min. Uh, yeah. Back throw back air. It kills at zero on plat on town. On That's any, absurd. On any 